very wonderful greeting to you all, the wonderful viewers of VITAP social media team, that you have always been a immense and a wonderful viewer of our channel and the updates. And here we have here with a very wonderful update for you all. How about you guys thinking uh, for the commutation on the university campus? Have you ever thought like walking kilometers, like you know, day from one class to other class, from one building to other building? Isn't it too tough and isn't it too boring? Maybe what if we introduce a wonderful vehicle for you, an electric vehicle that is very eco-friendly and you no know, very advantage for all the students here, not just students, but the faculties. As you see here, we have a wonderful electric vehicle named Prayana and the founders, the team members, the developers of this wonderful electric vehicle that is here with us here today. So, greening sir, greening, greening sir. Um, let me start. How did you get the name Prayana? What made you the name there? What suggests that? Anything very prominent with the product? Yes, of course, it's a uh, word from Prakriti's Prayana. So, Ayana in the sense, it's a vehicle. So, it's a nature vehicle. Uh, so, Prayana is a nature vehicle. Okay, a vehicle that have evolved from, you know, that goes hand in hand with the environment. And um, so, what made you build uh, this uh, project? What was the, uh, you know, the idea, the inspiration for this, such an innovative product? Yes. Uh, first of all, thank you for having us here today. Uh, this is our team uh, which we are working on our e-bike. Uh, yeah, I'm Dr. Ellison from Faculty of uh, Sense Department. He is my research scholar, uh, Ashok, and Shaira Banu. She is a UG student. So we are all, uh, actually we came uh, together to uh, work on this project. First of all, we thought about uh, the students' uh, problem, that is walking long distance from one building to another building uh, and that too in a hot weather like Vijayawada. So uh, in order to facilitate the students and uh, give them a good commuting uh, option, we came up with this e-bike. And uh, the main aim of this e-bike is to give a low cost e-bike. So we all know that nowadays e-bikes are very costly. So it is above uh, 1 lakh, 1.5 lakh and so on. And now we are giving this at around approximately 60,000. So that is the main feature of this e-bike and uh, we want students and faculty alike to use this e-bike to commute between different buildings such that it will help them out, not getting tired because there are there is only 10 minutes of gap between each class so it will help you uh, guys out. So the main features, let me uh, just explain. The first thing is uh, we are using swappable batteries uh, which is going to reduce charging time. So there is no waiting, zero waiting time for charging and second thing is we are using uh, LoRa communication for uh, and also IoT in order for uh, us to locate the different vehicles at different buildings. So we will immediately know on our smartphone where the uh, uh, vehicle is and we can book it with our ID cards itself because our ID cards have RFID, the authentication will be done and we can book it. Right, and these are uh, these are the main features of our e-bike, and rest of the things, the battery and all, we have limited the speed because this is a university campus. This is not roads, so we are limited it to a nominal speed of 25 kilometers per hour. This is for the safety. So, sir, there's a major concern that when it comes to electric vehicles, it's a major concern about the the char the run time. How many hours this will run for? And also the very important that is even a country like India, it's a developing country and then you know, uh, for the electric vehicle, the actual electric vehicles, we lack the, you know, the recharging stations and everything. So how are you uh, coming up with like, you know, you told it's a zero weight hour, it's a swappable battery. So are you planning to, you know, um, um, install a swapping station for the batteries and yes. also what is the runtime with the battery, a full charge? Could you please comment on that? Uh, actually, it depends on the battery size. How many different uh, uh, cells you have depends on that uh, charge uh, you can have and the time also depends on that. But since we have swappable batteries, that question is out of the window. We don't have to answer that question because we don't have any waiting time at all. And charging stations coming to that, we will install each charging station at each building. So one, uh, one charging station at AB2, AB1, central block and uh, all the hostels. So any everywhere you will get your battery availability and also immediately on the charging station itself, you can see the display, which uh, batteries are available for uh, full charge, which batteries are not. And immediately you can take them out, swap your uh, uh, discharged battery with a new battery immediately. So this seat is open and you can open it 
pull the battery out, put it in the charging station, take a new battery, put it in, just go. That's great, sir. No, it's like it's kind of a, feels like a very revolutionary idea and a very revolutionary you no know, uh, invention for this campus. It's a very huge campus and you no, know, it's a very a must need here. And how are you trying? Are you in a plan to upscale this to other universities or outside? Like any thought of any plan that now, right now? Uh, right now we are planning for our university, but definitely we have it on in our cards. Uh, we will provide the service if uh, it goes in a fruitful way to other campuses also. Okay, definitely. Yeah, that was and very. That's just very innovative, and it's like no, it's something that brings a smile on all, all our faces. That we no more have to you know once it's introduced, we no more have to walk from the camp from the buildings to buildings. It's like a a very wonderful handy help that can come for us. It's very handy, and uh, thank you, team. Uh, it's a it was very wonderful interviewing you. And you have to give, give us a very wonderful insight about the product. And we, as a team, as the VIP family, thank you for introducing, thank you for uh, no, getting to know our problems and trying to solve, at least make a step to solve the problem of people at VIT here for the, the main communication problems. And um, we wish you all the very best. Let you know you be upscaling this to other universities and pretty sure it's one of its own kind, actually. Um, it's like a very different and the names, everything, the design, it's wonderful. So, and there's no word to explain. I appreciate this. It was nice having you here. Thank you, Ashok sir. Thank you, Edison sir. Thank you, Thank you Shai Street. Thank you. All the best. Thank you. Thank you.